All right, first things first, 10 <laughs> out of 10. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Where did we get this? Where's this fit from? Talk to I me. wish I knew. I don't remember off the top of my head. But, uh, you know, my girlfriend, I got a girlfriend now. I got I to gotta look good for her. So. She's, <laughs> Dude, it's she, awesome. She make sure I look nice. I feel like you'd need, like, a cigar or something yeah, right? with that, too. But I, I know. Yeah, we're, tra we're training. Saturday we're training. Night, baby. Okay, get on the team. Yeah. Maybe that coat. Yeah, we'll maybe see. get you, like, the elbow patches, yeah. too. I got it. Um, <laughs> hey, coming to, you know, we're obviously, we're right outside of New York City. We're in Newark. Mm. We're the New Jersey Devils. We're at a massive arena, which you're used to. Oh, yeah. I know you're used to hockey arenas. We were in Detroit last year. <laughs> One of the craziest uh, heavyweight lifts and rolls yeah, right. I've ever seen. <laughs> but, uh, you know, Adam Kuhn, familiar foe, mm. right? Guys go back and forth a little bit, right? I don't even know. If, I don't even know if I, I could say back and forth. It was, uh, it was pretty one side up until recently. Yeah. Um, but, you know, hopefully hopefully get the record a little closer to even now. We'll yeah, see. well, that's what you got to do. Yeah. Kind of yeah. big brothered you for a while, though, didn't he? Yeah, I, was, I, would, I don't know if I would go that far. But uh, you know, I, was, I was a young guy. I was still coming around. Um, I was. I don't know if I was prepared uh, physically or, or or technically really to, to deal with a, an opponent like that yet. But uh, I'm here now and I'm, I'm prepared. How good do you feel? You know, coming into this, mm. looks like you put on a little size. Yeah. Am I making that up? No, just a little bit. Just a little bit. How I much? Think, I think last when, when he, last time he beat me at Olympic trials, I want to say I was only walking around like maybe 120 kilos on a good day. And uh, you know now now I've filled out. I got I got at least uh, watch what I eat. Get close to Wayne's now. Is there any cut? I wouldn't say cut. Cut's a stretch. Oh, nice workout before. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then I get you on. Maybe maybe eat half half a half a dinner the night before. Ha only half. Yeah, maybe. What's the biggest thing? You know, he's got leverage on you. He's a lot taller. He's probably four inches taller than you. What's the biggest thing with him in your matchups? Yeah, um, guys who got experience with Greco. You know, uh, being a tall guy, it's it's a it's advantage in some spots. But uh, in the pummel, as long as I stay underneath him, um, that negates a lot of that. And uh, you know, if I can get my hands locked, I have short arms. So if I got, if I lock my hands, anything's going to be tight. So uh, you know, hopefully score some points and uh, get my hand raised. I heard the gaming system is 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 next level. What? Tell me about your gaming system. Yeah. Coach, Coach Thompson said that you've got quite the gaming system. Talk to me about the gaming system. Yeah. Uh, as far as gaming goes, you know, it keeps me out of trouble. Uh, keeps me keeps me in my house. I don't I don't do nothing outside of practice. I usually just go home, rest up, hang out with my dog, and uh, hop on the PC a little bit. Um, you know, it depends it depends on the time, but uh, yeah, it's it's a blast. It keeps me out of trouble for sure. So it keeps you out, keeps you out the streets. Yeah. Oh yeah. Which this is the beat the streets event. You know, yeah. this is to to this is the largest fundraiser, and mm. this is what runs the operating budget for beat the streets in New York City, the five boroughs. What's it mean to come and you know help put on a show? Yeah. For one of the biggest events for you know an organization that helps kids get off the streets of the sport of wrestling. Yeah, it's an incredible organization. Um, I think the work they do with kids is awesome. Uh, you know, I think uh, I think wrestling's been such an amazing um, blessing in my life. So I hope I hope more kids get to experience it and get to have all the opportunities that I was blessed with um, being able to travel the world with this sport. So uh, you know if, if we can if we can uh, be here and inspire some even just one kid I feel like that's a win. If one person's inspired and uh, you know they they end up on the same stage as us you know 10 15 years down the road whatever it is it's a I'd see that as a huge accomplishment. I think that I think it'd be a beautiful thing. If you get those short gator arms locked around this man, could we see a ride? That's the plan, always. 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 Greco, that's always the plan. Lock my hands and pop. Uh, if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, got to grind out some ugly ones sometimes. But uh, if you can put some points on the board in a pretty way, it'd be, it'd be pretty great. All right. You got anything else for me? I don't think so. Where's that yeah. beautiful shirt? Does that beautiful shirt get into the city at all today? We'll see. I don't know. We'll see about it. All right. Hey, <laughs> thanks for the time. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you.